Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. This is Choki 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 from the top of the world, Anchorage, Alaska. It's been a minute, guys. Um, since, um, since salmon season has been over, it's been a minute, guys. And yeah, finally we got some snow. Finally it's cold. Some of the local lake has froze over, but I don't feel like it's safe enough for me to try to go venture because we got this snow and this cold front pretty late this year. It is November 17th and we barely got about two weeks worth of snow and it's still fairly warm it's like it's, it's still in the 30s like 33 35 37 the other day there was like uh wind and some uh, warm weather and yeah like some of the snow on the ground already all melted uh but yeah it's 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 back to getting cold it is 21 degrees today on my uh, temperature gauge and i am out and about looking for some ice fishing gear guys uh sadly last year towards the end of my season uh, someone went into my apartment garage and stole like 90 percent of my fishing stuff my tent my sled uh, my backpack with my gopro my accessories my tackle uh, my heater a whole bunch of stuff got stolen i did file a police report but you know i haven't heard it since I'm pretty sure I'm never gonna ever see it again. It's okay to the person who took it, to the person who did take it. Uh, I have nothing but you know, uh, love and and hope for you. Okay, uh, you probably need it more than I do. Um, majority of those stuff were uh, funded through fundraiser and donated from like friends and family. So uh, I am okay with you borrowing it without letting me know. But yeah, guys, uh, back to the story. Today we are gonna be at. B&J Sporting Good. We're going to be checking out some ice fishing tackle, some ice fishing gear. Um, we're going to be uh, just uh, hanging out, looking at stuff to see if anything piques our interest. And yeah, we do got a few uh, things on our bucket list to check off for uh, a, a fun and successful ice fishing season. So yeah, um, I, I won't be recording a lot. Like I'm not gonna be walking around recording, but I'm gonna get to like a certain spot and just do like uh, maybe like one or two minute uh, film of what they tune guys. I'm gonna take you guys to B&J Sporting Good. If you guys never been to B&J Sporting Good, it is the last remaining brick and mortar mom and pop outdoor supply uh, commercial uh, fishing gear store left in the city of Anchorage, guys. See you guys in a bit inside the store, okay? Here's a little bit how the store looks like. They got a lot of unique rod. Looking for some uh, local tackle plastic. I'm being told that there's supposed to be some here. Hook of Alaska, right here. Hook of Alaska. I decided to pick up this uh, Ion Alpha uh, G3, uh, third gen. It is not the composite version, it is the steel um, version. And the reason why I went with the steel version was because of the Alaska uh, winter conditions here. It is like, way more colder and way more thicker ice and way more harder ice. So I think the steel is gonna be uh, the better route for me. And yeah, man super excited looking forward to man running this uh, electric auger uh sorry uh, guys i didn't go with the strike master uh, option because way too many people went with it and i seen some video and i wasn't really too impressed with the cost of it this was not a bad deal uh, this was a fairly decent deal let me show you guys the price tag where the price tag go uh right there okay just gonna show you guys what i picked up and that i'm super excited can't wait to use this uh out this uh ice fishing winter season super stoked finally going electric hell yeah super stoked i finally got into the electric auger uh, side of the world um the reason why i went with the ion was there was like a lot of great review guys uh, either it was the ion or the strike master and for uh, a amazing deal that i got um i went with the ion guys um it is not the composite uh auger bit but it is the steel auger bit the reason why i went with the steel auger bit was felt like the steel would have done a better job and there was so much impressive review on youtube and i decided to go with the ion um nothing against strike master i just felt like the strike master's design was a little bit too big and bulky and i've uh, handled one before my past experience uh owning an electric auger 
with a 40 volt um, motor it's going to be a better fishing experience than uh, old school uh, gas auger I had a lot of issue with uh, my uh, gas auger last year um, I bought it new I bought it brand new from Cabela's and in the middle of the season the blade was like pretty dull already probably drill at least about like 50 holes with it and then like close to the end of the season the car was having issue it had idling problem uh, I reached out to customer service and it was really great customer service great customer experience um, I got a new carburetor I mean you could buy one off the internet for like 20 bucks they sent me out a carburetor I threw it in there and then uh, yeah it was great how they took care of me uh, like that but man uh, there was like oil leakage the whole nine yard heavy out there fishing heavy um, yeah, I hope this uh, electric uh, auger will change my fishing experience this year. Super excited, super stoked. I uh, want to give a big shout out to my uh, uh, loving wife for uh, being a part of this purchase. And I want to give a big shout out to CJ for consulting me on to buying this and also giving me a really amazing, great deal. So, so excited, guys. Can't wait to hit the water. I'm going to do some uh, product review and I'm also going to do an unboxing. Stay tuned. Other than that, guys, if you guys are new to the channel, my name is Choki Choki Choki. I love fishing. Fishing brings people together. I do a lot of Alaska fishing. In the winter time, I do a lot of ice fishing too. Um, if you like my content, please make sure to subscribe. Okay, so in the future, when I drop some uh, new video, you will get to see, you, you will get a notification. Other than that, guys, uh, see you guys. Super excited, super stoked, man. Can't wait, can't wait, can't wait. Here we go. Ice fishing 2023-2024. Super excited.